Hey, welcome back on the narration of Carus and Additional 5. I'm Zokuru, and today I'm bringing up a game between Jabba the Griffin and Undisputed. Uh, Jabba the Griffin is on the bottom, and Undisputed is on the top. And we'll get right into it because I don't think any of this player needs any introduction. Uh, they are both really, really great players uh, that don't really play uh, nowadays, but both are pretty serious about that tournament. So, yeah, let's get right into it. Uh, so, there is Lead Zabdos for Undisputed and Lead Tyranitar for Trainer Orange, which is, which is Java. And. Uh, that's a Miss Rock Slide on a Thunderbolt, so that, that sucks. And there is... Oh, that's a Bent Tyranny Tower, and that's a big chunk for, for Broloom, and uh, this t -tar will uh, just slip. Okay. Uh, so, that Bent Rock Slide would have killed Zabdos for sure, so that miss is a bit unlucky. Okay, now there is Gengar in. Uh, will it be Ice Punch or Willow Wisp or Hypnosis or whatever? It will be Ice Punch, okay. And now there will be Skarmory in and there will be uh, one uh, Spikes down. Okay, there is uh, the Focus Punch and is there uh, another Focus Punch or is it a Rock Slide? It will be a Rock Slide on the Swampers coming. So. There will probably be an edge pump right here, yeah, but it will miss. Okay, that's pretty unfortunate for Jabba, who missed already two moves on that dab dose. That seems uh, really threatening, especially with a sub down. Okay, so uh, here there will be Jolteon in, and there will be Baron Pass, and Broom will come back and probably uh, click a Focus Punch, or if it has it, maybe he can try to. Stun Spore the Gengar, yeah, that's what will happen because as we saw, it's not Pursuit Tyranitar, so you need something to threaten Gengar with that problem. There is no HP Ghost, though, so yeah, just Tyranitar will come. That's probably a Lumber Tatar, and there will be uh, maybe a Rock Slide. Nah, there will be a hard uh, HP Grass, which will make progress, and I think it's a great uh, move to have on this set with, with this team for what we saw. And yeah, there will be the second HP Grass, that Swampert is basically dead, but uh, that Tita will go down too, so that's a trade. But, uh, I'm not sure if the Jirachi has another move than Ice Punch to eat the Swampert, so I think the trade is probably in favor of uh, Undisputed. Uh, okay, there is a Roar here, so uh, maybe that Jolteon doesn't have T-Wave. Or maybe it was just a prediction. Here we, we will have a T-Ball that Undisputed cannot, cannot come in, it seems. Um, and there will be a Baron Bass because uh, you don't kill Dux Row from this range, it seems. If it's a really, really uh, specially defensive one. There will be the second Spikes Down and Jolchon um, will come back because you know that those doesn't touch you because it revealed sub BP, so it cannot have a T wave, so you're fine. There will be T bolt and there will be HP something, we don't know. And there will be the second T bolt threatening to KO. Doctor will be uh, sacrificed here, or maybe uh, GRG will be doubled. Nah, Doctor will be sacrificed, and GRG will come, and there will be. He bolt into Roar, I think is the play for Jabba. It should leave everything at plus one. And that Jolteon look like it's gonna win. Oh no, because it will be created by uh, Ice Punch, and therefore you cannot use your Alakazam on back to win the game uh, after that Roar resolved. So, yeah, maybe if that Thunder misses. There is a shot for Jabba. Uh, Sunder doesn't miss, so yeah, that's that sucks because eating two Sunder in a row is about 50-50 uh, odds, and then there was that crit, so yeah, that's a crit into a 50-50 odds. It's yeah, I wouldn't be very happy if I, if it, that happened to me, but yeah, uh, it seems that this Dabdos will just walk away with the game and. If it doesn't 
have the para on that on that Gengar is then uh, you will have just GH trying to uh, input some damages on the Gengar and uh, if uh, the last Pokemon doesn't die to explosion it should be good for Undisputed and there is indeed a Suicune so uh, Surf will be down, Tibolt no para and uh, there will be two Surf to win the game here and yeah 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 that's really really unlucky for Jabba first there was that rock slide miss at the beginning and then what so at the end but there is still a second game for for Java to to come back so um, we will uh, see that okay that's game two and if Jabba loses this game, uh, he will be uh, out of Chaos Invitational 5. If he wins, he will go to uh, game 3. Um, Jabba is still on the bottom and Undisputed is still on the top. Top. So let's get right into it. Salamence lead versus Metagross. Metagross should leave everything from, from Salamence, even a Fire Blast, right? And there is a Crit Marsh, so... Yeah, I think that that kind of make up for the last turn one uh, of the first game. But yeah, okay, there is a Magneton versus Magneton. Uh, there is HP Fire and HP Fire, and I guess this is a tie. But yeah, Jabba just loses it. Um, if it wasn't a tie, I don't know why Jabba would would play that because he has a Celebi, so there is no need. I think there will be Mash, and there will be no Raise. And there will be Suicune in, and there will be a boom right away. So, yeah, I don't know if it's great for Jabba. I don't think so because, well, oh, there is another boom. Okay, so you don't really have the time to talk about the game here. And there is EQ, there is Curse, and is there a boom here? I would say there is a boom, so maybe you need to switch out if you are Jabba. Doesn't switch out, Suikun in, I hope that last is like a Zapdos or something that beats Suikun. And this is a Salamence, so there is DD and does Ice Beam kill. Ice Beam doesn't kill, so if you get a flinch and you'd get nothing. So that's a pretty brutal game too, and Undisputed will walk away with the series. Undisputed will still be on the loser bracket for round 3 and Jabba will be out of Karus Invitational Tournament 5 uh, well Karus Invitational 5 no tournament here but yeah that's that's all for this series um, I hope you liked it I hope you liked the plays and the players and uh, I will be uh, right back with another series another day but uh, it's over for today and uh, see you guys in the next one.